Hi guys, so this is a requested video. Um, some of you guys asked if I could show how I store all my bags, my shoes, my clothes, my accessories. And um, I'd actually been thinking about it, but you know, once I got the request, I was like, okay, yeah, maybe I should do it. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna show you how I store my stuff. It's nothing extraordinary or over the top, um, but I hope you enjoy it regardless and maybe you can pick up some ideas for yourself. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna get right into it. All right, so just to begin with, basically everything is in my wardrobe. I'm lucky that this new place that I'm at, um, I've got enough room to put everything away. So as you can see here, the only things that I hang on the outside are my bags that I use regularly. Um, I'm a bit of a hanger. I like buying hooks and sticking them on cupboards and just hanging things. So on the left, I've got my Ankara bag that you guys have seen before. In the middle here, I've got the bags that I really love and, you know, I wear quite often or I use quite often. And on this side here, I've got my Safwa bag. All right, so opening the far left one up, um, this is what's inside. So as you can see at the top here, I've got some bags. Um, these are the ones that I don't necessarily use all the time. So I just store up there. And I've also got my hats as well, um, my caps, and they just kind of chill up there. Um, once again, because I don't use them all the time. And then on the inside here, um, those black long kind of straps, my mum actually got them for me and they hook at the top of the cupboard and also at the bottom as well. And basically they've got these hooks on them and there's quite a few of them along, along the black strip and you can just hook stuff on it. So this one, I've got lots of room still, but this one is pretty much used up um, with my scarves and stuff. All right, so inside here, I've got these plastic drawers. Um, inside the white ones is just like books and stuff. And then um, on the other side is just like stuff that I wear at home. But on top of it, I keep all my clutches. So on the left, I've got, you know, a lot of my African print clutches, the Ankara ones, um, some ASOS ones at the back. Um, on the right, I've got some of my box clutches, my clear clutches, and, um, you know, some handbags that are not too big. Um, up here, you can see that's a belt. It's a metal one, and I couldn't find anywhere to place it, so I just put it on top. And also, I've got some choker necklaces there, which I actually took the chains off them, so I can't hang them up, so they're just sitting up there. On this side, I've got these... Uh, plastic kind of divider things um, you stick a coat hanger in them and you can hang them up and that's where I previously put all my accessories so bangles studs you know uh, necklaces whatnot but these ones that are currently in here I rarely use but they're just there um, so that's the first one on the second coat hanger I've got all my belts so I've got all my gold plated ones and also some other ones that I don't always use but yeah they're there anyway now on the inside of this door as you can see I've got all my necklaces so with the top uh, hook I've got you know a lot of my um, chain link necklaces ID necklaces um, on the left here I've got like my really interesting statement ones the Egyptian ones the ones that are really quite stunning this middle one here I've got ones that are kind of like everyday type ones you know ones that I wear quite often on the right hand side here I've got some more statement necklaces but yeah that's just how I like to do it because I like to see um, everything on display and it kind of makes it feel like you know you're really like shopping your own closet or your wardrobe and then I've got another one of those divider bags at the bottom and I've put all my sunglasses and then at the bottom I've got some head wraps and scarves that um, you know I sometimes wear when I want to rock the turban look and in this middle section here I basically have all my clothes this is the stuff that I wear on a day-to-day -day basis you know going to work stepping out that kind of thing it's not color-coded as you can see I tend to put my stuff by style and cut that kind of thing um, I think eventually though I would want to get to the place where you know it's all color coded but I have so much color that it's really hard um, so yeah basically on this side here I've got all my button down shirts and tops um, short sleeve ones the longer sleeve ones that kind of thing is on this side here then moving here I've got crop tops um, I've got singlets and tank tops 
basically all the tops that I can wear with pants or jeans are here and then I've got my skater skirts and my shorter skirts and then moving along I've got all my skater dresses here you guys know I love skater dresses so they're all in this section here and then I've got some midi length dresses I've got this fringe one my ASOS one and also there's a jumpsuit as well kind of like sticking with the length um, so that's why they're all together and then I move on to my um, you know long pants my faux leather pants and my jeans are all here and then here I've got all my maxi dresses you know the ones that I can wear out keep them together and then lastly on the far right I have all my entire stuff so my tops my dresses my skirts my long skirts they're all here now moving on to the uh, last part of the wardrobe this is mainly where I keep a lot of my church stuff um, so I've got my tops that I can wear to church um, I've got my pencil and midi skirts that I can wear to church and then I've got all my blazers cardigans you know jackets long coats they're all on this side here and then on this side here um, I keep basically all the pieces of clothing that I have but I haven't yet worn and some of them I have put pieces together because they're looks that I want to wear at some stage so you know here are a few Ankara pieces that I'm yet to wear that you know I want to wear at some point there's some blazers I haven't worn yet um, some midi skirts you know so yeah I try and keep all the stuff I haven't worn on one side you know so I remember that I do have stuff that you know I haven't worn because sometimes you go through your wardrobe you're like I have nothing to wear but in fact you know there are still things that have tags in them so um, yeah that stuff is all over there my challenge to myself this year was um, to not purchase as much clothing and instead really try and recreate um, different looks with the stuff that I already have because I definitely want to make use of the things that I do have occasionally you know I go through and there are pieces that I don't like anymore um, I know I won't wear I don't want to wear so you know I'll put it away um, some of it I take home and give to my cousins and that kind of thing some I give to you know friends people at church it all depends on how I'm feeling but I like to give stuff away um, when I know I'm not going to use it and someone else will be you know happy with it or will benefit from it. Alright so down the bottom here underneath where all my church items are is where I have all my heels and shoes or the bulk of them so I've got all my wedges down the bottom I've got shoes um, where the studded ones are and the fuchsia pink ones are um, they're the heels that are a bit more thick and chunky this middle section is my go-to one it's got like my sandals and my ankle strap heels the ones I wear regularly and also behind um, this row here I've got some more ankle strap shoes um, the ones with the gold heels they're kind of tucked behind this row and up the top I've got my pointed shoes and my closed you know closed toe shoes so yeah this is basically where I keep all my heels and stuff that give me some height and underneath where I uh, do my makeup is where I have all my flat shoes um, as you can see my shoes are on these steel um, shoe racks and I like these ones because they're actually like extendable so in the other space it's the shortest length possible but in this space here I have a bit more room so I was able to extend them and as you can see I've got like sneakers and closed toe shoes my brogues my flats um, yeah that are covered got a few more on this side at the bottom at the top here I've got you know the bulk of my sandals and and stuff that I can wear in summer and then lastly I'm um, just on top of my little um, bookcase which is next to my bed like my little bedside space this is where I keep like my bracelets and stuff that I wear um, a bit more regularly so my um, beads that I got in Ghana um, I have all my watches and then I've got like my studs and stuff and a few rings and things that you know I wear a bit more often than the stuff that was in the wardrobe um, and there's a picture of my boo right there so guys that's it that's basically how I store everything I hope you know you found it useful I hope maybe you got an idea in there so thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video
Bye.